Alright, what's going on guys? So I've been uh, trying to do this video, but I'm making it way too long and kind of boring. And it's something I wouldn't want to watch. But anyway, um, a couple of you have asked me how uh, our luck has been during our opening day since Sunday. Um, it's the third day into our spring turkey season. We got out Sunday and we got out Monday. Uh, long story short, we got busted before daylight heading into uh, the second property. Uh, big old Tom was roosting right there at the tree uh, to the entrance way. And it was quarter after five by the time we got to the spot. There wasn't any birds chirping. It was still dark. So I don't understand how uh, the Tom was even awake on the roost and busted us. But that kind of sucks. Um, gave some calls. Heard him gobble a couple times. But it wasn't too enthusiastic. He didn't commit to come in or wanting to see... You know what the deal was with the calling. We were there for an hour and 45 minutes, decided to pack up uh, the decoys and then head back to the other side of the field, the bean field, to uh, set up on another set of pines where there's a lot of uh, turkey tracks and turkey feathers and whatnot where they happen to be hanging out in the bean field. And as we were getting ready to walk out, there was a flock starting to come out from the hedgerow into the bean field. And the lead hen had went back and forth, got nervous and stopped. And I didn't move, and hopefully, had thought, hopefully, um, they would continue to come out to where we'd slowly back off, get the decoy set up on the edge of the field, do some calling, and have them come in. Unfortunately, uh, whatever it was that let our presence be known made her too uncomfortable, and they hightailed it back into the woods. So, uh, I can't say it was unsuccessful. Uh, we're, we're seeing them. It's just, it happens to be that I think these particular turkeys happen to be uh, tactical ninja turkeys and are pretty damn smart. You never know. <laughs> but anyway, um, yeah, so we know where they are. Um, we just need to switch things up a little bit to be more productive um, with our time and be able to get it a little closer. As far as for the time in the morning, besides camping out all night there and watching them going to roost and waking up at 4 in the morning and just waiting until it gets light out to where they come down, I have no idea. But we'll, we'll figure something out. Um, also, I need some help from anybody. Anybody who's familiar and uses Microsoft Movie Maker, um, send me a personal message or leave a comment on this video. Uh, main reason... I did three short video clips um, from yesterday, and it would be pretty stupid to post three little clips, and then if you watched one before the other one, it wouldn't make any sense. So I did the video, put it together, I saved it, went to post it to YouTube, and it says it is not the uh, supportable format, or the format's not supported or something, and it will not let me post it. Um, so this video is kind of just a wrap up of what happened yesterday, but I'd like to get that video out so you guys can see um, the setups that we're working with, a, a couple of the setups that we're working with for this season. So with that said, um, I'm looking forward to the responses and some help. Um, other than that, I'm going to go ahead and cut it out. As always, guys, be safe, have fun, and I'll catch you later.